everyone, welcome to Priya's Kitchen. Today I am going to share everyone's favorite and special breakfast recipe that is Puri. Today I am going to share that Puri with Alu Curry also. Let's start the process. First we need to prepare our Puri dough. In a mixing bowl, add 1 cup of wheat flour, 1 tablespoon of suji that is semolina. It gives nice crispiness and uh, helps our puri to puff up for long time. Salt to taste. One tablespoon of oil. Mix it well. Now add little by little water and make it stiff too. Add one more teaspoon of oil and grease the dough. Our dough should be nice and stiff like this. So our dough is ready. Cover it with lid and rest for half an hour. Meanwhile, we make our puri curry. Heat one tablespoon of oil in a pan. Add one teaspoon of mustard seeds. Add onions, finely chopped. You have to take more onions for this curry. I have taken two potatoes, for that I have taken three onions. Add three green chilies, curry leaves, salt. Fry the onions till they change their color lightly. No need to fry till they get golden brown. So our onions became translucent. Now add 1 teaspoon of turmeric powder, mix it, now take our boiled potato and just lightly mash with your hands like this, do not mash it fully, mix it. Fry the potatoes for 1 or 2 minutes. Add some water. Mix it well. At this stage, taste it and adjust the salt as per your liking. Cook the curry for 5 minutes. So our curry is boiling nicely for 5 minutes. Now, I have mixed some Basin in some water that is chickpea flour. There should not be any lumps in it. Now pour this mixture into curry. It gives nice thickness to our curry. This is optional. If you don't want, you can skip it. Mix it well and cook for five more minutes. So our curry became nice and thick. It is ready. Finally, add some coriander. Mix it well. So our alu curry is ready. Switch off the flame. So our curry is ready. Let's start making our puris. Heat some oil for deep frying. Now mix the dough once again. Take some portion of dough. And make it to small rounders. Now take one round. And roll it like this. Make a smooth round. Dip it in the dry flour, just a little flour, not too much. You can also use oil for rolling, but I feel comfortable with this dry flour. Roll it gently, do not roll very thin, it should be some thick. The thickness should be nice and even, then our puri will puff up nicely. Let's make a couple of them. So I have made a couple of puris. Let's fry them. Now place our puri gently. Gently press it like this. It will nicely puff up. And pour some oil. Nicely puffed up. Take it out. Put one more puri. 
plastic, pour some oil. If you mix the dough perfectly then we will get every puri puffed up like this. So yummy and delicious puri with aloo curry is ready. I love puri. Let me taste it. Very nice. Awesome. The curry is so nice. Very nice. Try it in your home. Thank you for watching. I hope you enjoyed today's session of making puri and aloo curry. If you like my recipe, hit the like button and share my video with your friends and family members. See you soon with some more recipes. Till then, take care. Bye bye.